My Lord. What is your report? <clears throat> it is as we have heard, my Lord. They have taken our goods, and the city of Zileg has burned to the ground. There is nothing left. And what of the women and children? They have been taken captive by the uh, Amalekites. Am yes. God save them. Akish, there is no time. If we are to recover what is ours, we need, we need to act quickly. Bring me the oracle so that I may inquire whether or not we should pursue. Yes, my lord. My lord, there is one more matter. What is it? The men, my lord, they speak of revolt. They seek revenge at the point of a sword. And they wish my head to be at that point if they do not recover what is theirs. Well, what of it? What do you see? Where is he? I must speak to him. Patience. You will find us now that we are looking. Ah, yes. I have found the spirit you wish to contact. He comes for you. Why have you disturbed me? Uh, I seek your counsel. The Lord God will not speak to me through a dream nor through his oracles. And what of it? You chose to abandon him and go on your own path of disobedience. You wish to know about the coming battle with the Philistines and your and your whether or not victory will be yours. Yes, yes, dear Samuel, yes. The Lord has abandoned you. You and your sons will be killed and your kingdom given to another. Your dynasty is finished. Drink up, men, for tonight we celebrate our victory. Saul has killed his thousand and David his ten thousand, but they were no match for the might and cunning of the Amalekite forces. General laughter. <laughs> Soldier. Sir, our forces are being overrun. It is David and his militia. Captain. What? How many are there? Soldier. Around 400. Coming from the... I am Amara, son of Agag, commander of the Amalekite forces of Negeb. I am Ronan, David, son of Jesse, exile of Israel by Saul. It is just as he said, they're dead. They're all dead. My dear sweet Jonathan, dead. My son's dead. And soon they will be here to take me. I will not allow my body to be defiled. You must help me save my honor. You must be my what? My, my lord, I, I cannot. You dare defy your king? Saul falls to his knees and pulls out a small dagger. Draw your sword, boy! There is no time! nervously draws his sword and raises it above his head. In this act, I am victorious!
Ah, my dear wife Michaela, it is a glorious week, for we have recovered you from the Amalekite. My dear, what is it? Michael, my lord, you shall be king. David, what? Then, Michael, my father Saul and my brother Jonathan have been killed in battle. David, sick with shock. My king, my sword brother, dead. 